Well, the High Commission of India in Ottawa in a press release said that its uh, consulates uh, general in Toronto and Vancouver uh, have decided to resume the visa services from the 26th of October. India will resume visa services for entry visa, business visa, medical visa and conference visa. And the High Commission said, and I quote, let us tell you that uh, Indian visa services in Canada was uh, suspended for a month in September after Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's allegation of the involvement of agents of the Indian government in the killing of Hardeep Singh Nijjar, who is the chief of the banned Khalistan Tiger Force. And now we have decided to resume visa services in some categories. Ambassador Suresh Kumar Goel, former diplomat, joins us on the broadcast to talk more about this. Ambassador Goel, a very good morning to you, sir. Good morning, Vidhi. Well, morning. sir, will it be right to say that uh, you know there is a thaw in the standoff that uh, India and, and Canada have been pursuing for some weeks now? Uh, I think it would be a bit of a rush, but uh, uh, haste to say that there is a thaw in the relations because. We need to wait for some more signals from the Canadian side also as maybe in response to what India has done or maybe as a kind of a recognition that they do need to take some steps to allay India's concerns and also India's questions, India's uh, uh, questions regarding uh, terrorist activities targeted from the Canadian soil. But I would call it a welcome development because it would allow many of the Canadians who have scheduled their visit to India either for tourism or for business or for medical facilities, uh, etc., et conferences. And when the people begin to travel once again to India, uh, it will be a welcome thing because they will understand. I think that will really develop and improve the understanding of Indian position and we also help the Indian case. So in my in my view, it's a very welcome uh, development, both politically, economically, and sociologically. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon.